Let's play the qualifying round at challenger level of the Australia Biodiversity Open in Tennis Clash, a sports game published by Wildlife Studios. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel Gameplay365 and to turn on the bell if you like this video. So let's join the challenger tournament with 2 million coins. I'm going to start the matches with the high serve. Two strong hands with a rather weaker backhand first. Let's try with the plyometrics instead of the resistance band, which is the card that I use usually in the previous uh, qualifying rounds when I play with Luke. Let's play versus Barra. A very good counter puncher. He's playing very well with Florence. You have seen him destroy me two times in the previous uh, final round of the Cyber Open organized on clay. Okay. Oh my gosh. Yep. One. Can't do anything here. Problem of this build is that uh, my Victoria is pretty slow. <laughs> and then, should we need to uh, die return almost uh, on shots if they are hit hard enough? And it was not accurate. So I have a not bad self stat with that build. But the problem is that she's too slow. Yep. She can't do anything. This is uh, such an agile Florence. And she's outflanked all the time by his hitting very hard. And then that is almost impossible. Yep. Impossible really to return those shots well that's a bagel bad start well let's uh, change the plyometrics by the resistance band to have a slightly better backhand the serve stat will be reduced okay Agility of 50 versus an agility of 80 of uh, this Florence. Wow, it's almost the same build than the one used by Bar, my first opponent. Oh, actually, after watching carefully the stats, it's exactly the same build. Except that Barrett, my opponent in this match, is using the anniversary string, which will make my Victoria's forehand look like a chine shot yep her forehand will not be strong anymore this is a very good string for a user versus a high serve big forehand or high serve two strong hands players especially if uh, you are having a lot of stamina which is the case of this Florence because in that case, the stamina she on tier 1 of this anniversary string is not a problem anymore. So this point was quite funny. <laughs> yeah, Florence was running everywhere and then... <laughs> yep, I could not outflank her. Yeah, that's very easy for her to uh, catch everything. And she only needs uh, one strong backhand. Given that high agility and... A lot of stamina plus the uh, forehand counter of this anniversary string. Plus, Barat is a very good player. So, all of those elements added together, well, that gives another bagel. So, that's two bagels in a row. Well, looks like I'm not going to keep on playing with this high serve, two strong hands style during this qualifying round. Let's switch to the uh, volley. Yep. Let's go, Leo versus a very high stamina Kaito having a huge backhand. He's using the Kaito sourcing. All right. 
Yep. Obviously, it's not the same agility anymore. So it's easier to uh, to return even weekly and then just stand there near the net. I didn't uh, think about playing with uh, Volley during this qualifying round, but well, looks like things are forcing me to uh, play with it very simply because I am uh, not going to play with counter puncher. You know that I can't hit hard with uh, Kato or Florence on my Android phone, so it's useless for me to try to play with the counter puncher style. The build used by uh, the first and the second opponent of this qualifying round, Bar and Barat, is uh, very good, but uh, it only suits uh, players who can hit hard shots on their phone. And if you can't hit hard, because you play on uh, an Android phone, which is not very modern, or you're not playing on iOS, well, you can switch to volley. The volley style doesn't need to uh, to hit very hard, except for the serve. But generally, even on uh, phones that don't register the uh, the swipe as being fast, well, you can still serve fast. Because this, I don't know, this is just uh, registered differently. And because this is the first shot that you make, actually. So you don't have to return a hard shot or medium shot. That means that you can hit it at full power no matter what, if you can swipe it fast enough. So that's funny to see that I can serve with a full blue bar, but I can never hit with an almost full blue bar. Whenever I play with Kaito Offerings, that's really too bad. I have tried. I did try a lot lately with him in the Tour 8, but <laughs> and that's why I have lost hundreds of trophies. That's impossible. I have tried everything. Baby Powder, Vaseline. So Vaseline can work when I play with Victoria or Luke. I can hit uh, at uh, more than 90%, sometimes 95% of the blue bar, but with Kaito, it's never the case. Can't believe that. And all my opponents playing with Kaito, and they are very powerful. They hit really hard. I just play uh, JJ today with um, 64 only forehand and backhand. Both are 64, he was hitting much, much harder than a 70 or 71 stat. Looks like, because he can hit very hard, just look at like he, he was hitting with a 71 backhand and, and forehand. It was really very hard to counter in shots. And well, I don't even talk about the, the Kaito who are playing in Tour 8. A lot of having 74 forehand, 73 backhand. I mean, for a, a Kaito, that's huge. And, well, that's very tricky. So I try I try to hit hard, and when I saw that it's impossible, I try to play the, wow. uh, the counter punchers, the real counter punchers style. <laughs> Trying just to, uh, to counter every shot with accuracy and that's all but well doesn't more work uh, versus uh, old players all right let's go back to the matches we are facing a high serve big forehand low here very high serve stat pretty big forehand using the koala string which is the brand new special string Release in the app just for this Australia Biodiversity Open. 
It is a next silent string, really. Backhand counter. Stamina shear on tier 2, critical on tier 2. This is a special string which is very useful to play versus the volley players. Especially if you have uh, at least one very strong hand. And then you win. You have a lot of uh, chance to hit a critical shot. Gosh, huge forehand. Very nice. Okay, another punishment. And with the stamina shield tier 2, well. Okay, got lucky here. You need a bit of luck anyway to trigger a quick catch often. And this time, yeah. Because I know that he's he likes to hit uh, that way. I just stand there at the right side of my court to receive that uh, big shot by the end. All right. Well, things are going a bit better with the volley. For sure, it's uh, totally different to play with a 75 agility than with a 50 agility of a Victoria. And I don't know why, but if I remember, during the two first matches, I didn't feel, I just couldn't feel that I was hitting hard shots. Like uh, when I was playing with uh, Luke during the previous uh, tournaments qualifying rounds. One, Don't know why. Two, so it's uh, it's the same forehand stat. Luke only has uh, one two, better five. backhand stat. One point. One more point. Whoops! I kind of fell my volley there, but fortunately, three, it was not a big problem. No, not good. So my opponent is having uh, pretty much more stamina. And he should be fine by the end of the match. Wow, tough it was it. If uh, we can't break each other, he will have the advantage of the stamina. I will have much less stamina by the end, and then he will be able to uh, hit the smash without fearing any uh, counter volley. Right, let's accelerate a bit, a small part only. This was not a very long match, but well, it's not very interesting, so I will play at normal speed only for the two last points, which will be the case soon. Yep. Here we go. So he won't just smash there. It's my turn to serve. If he breaks, then that's over. And that's it. Well played. Yeah. Well done. Well, at least I have to score six points. It's not too bad. All right. Let's play this is uh, Florence. Wow, for once she hasn't uh, used the Keto sourcing. Not like the two first Florence I met. One. All right. She's really moving fast. 
Unbelievable. Don't know why. Florence always gives the impression that she's moving f faster than Kaito. That's weird. She has exactly the same agility stat, but... See, she just looks much more dynamic. Moving much faster. So... Visually, that's weird to see such a difference. It's a ball of energy. Yeah, I guess very badly where she was going to hit there. Okay, this is exactly what I'm talking about. This is the kind of shot that I can never hit with Florence or Kaito. Can never hit that fast on my phone. So, yep. Some subs have uh, asked me to play with Kaito lately in f the uh, qualifying round, but I have to, uh, to say that it's not possible. Well, at least uh, not before I uh, buy an iPad Pro. I plan to buy an iPad Pro to uh, try and... No, actually not to try because I know that I will hit fast with Kaito on an iPad Pro. I have already seen that and I have already uh, swiped fast even on an iPhone XR. So I know that on iOS there's no problem. But uh, what I mean is that uh, I still try to uh, to find a way somehow. It would be a good challenge to somehow accelerate a bit and make it my phone register my swipe as being fast with Kaito. I don't know how. Maybe I should combine plenty of things like uh, a gaming sleeve on the finger plus the baby powder or the gaming sleeve and some Vaseline and I don't know, I don't know. I still need to find a trick to to do that but it would be a very, a very cool. If I could make a video one day with the title how to make your Android phone register your swipe as being fast in Tennis Clash. I know that a lot of subs are having the same problem than me. They have already uh, confirmed that problem. Yep. Well, let's face uh, Fabio13 who is uh, playing a lot uh, with uh, the volley style, so it will be hard. As you know, I play always very bad versus volley players when I use the volley style. I really need to do uh, more training matches with the Tennis Clash friends in the game to play more volley versus volley. This is good. This is exactly the kind of a trick that I need to practice. I say that because I have seen many experienced volley players do that already. That looks very simple, but you need to train to do that. Well, this one, <laughs> I've already seen two. Need to practice that too. Even if uh, that's just a cosmetic thing. Yep. Okay. Well, not much I could do here. He play very well. All right. Well, let's hope I can face a baseliner because I can mostly 
score versus baseliners. Wow, cool. So the game has pity of me and he's giving me a less tough opponent, at least in theory. Well, his opponent is hitting very hard, so a 53 backhand looks really hard, very strong. Okay. Well, let's go. Yes. Quest, okay. You know, I failed my server. Wow. Oh. All right. Obviously, things are easier for a volley player if he can uh, serve fast. Yeah, no, not a good return at all. Very bad positioning. Bad volley too. Come on. That was not good. This time I got there on time to counter this cross court shot. And I guess correctly, but this Florence was going to hit there. This cross court. All right, lucky victory. So as you can see, I don't open backs anymore. This because it's not well. It's not useful anymore. I am going to buy the cards directly in the store and then use the max out cards exchange system as a bonus as a compliment so as to try and get the remaining cards so yeah basically now i'm going to save james to buy directly the hammer in the forge which are the two cards i need the most now One. Cabo load resistance band is only uh, will only be bonus. Okay, well, space amb your seventy seven. Very good player. We defeated me uh, quite easily in the uh, previous final round. Out. Two. My Leo is having a hard time. Okay. Well, fortunately, not so many players have uh, used the color string. Because otherwise it would be very hard. Three. All right. Because I know that he loves to love. I don't rush to the net anymore. <laughs> I just run there casually. Almost waiting for him to hit the lob. Okay, well, this time was not too bad. All right, let's do the secondary match to try and improve this 0 7 score. Well, I can only do better than 0 7 for sure. And KS 17 again. Well, this time I 
don't have uh, the same opponent too many times. That's good. Wow. Only this one, tw twice. But otherwise, there's not much uh, repetition. Wow. So that's cool. Okay. Wow. Nice shot. All right. Yes. Even with that stamina, that's not enough to use the Punisher gut. This string is really well. It may be useful if you can end match quickly, otherwise, it's completely useless. Makes you consume too much stamina. And that was not too bad. Well, let's do this uh, third rematch because 61 win should not be enough. It might be only. But let's do this third rematch. Yeah, the two first matches were really a big problem. Well, at least I have solved them and have caught up. Oh my gosh, quarter string will be hard. That will be hard because this Florence is having two strong hands. So let's see if. Uh, oh yeah. She's hitting hard too. Okay. Oh, not always. Oh my gosh. Big, big forehand. Fortunately, I get some points now and then with some hits catching the net. Right. No, not good. Not a good volley, fortunately. This Florence is sending is too long. Oh my gosh. No, no, no way. No way I can do something good. That. Yep. This is the scholar string. Okay. Of course, it's not only a matter of string. Yeah, my opponent is playing very well, too. I'm not saying that uh, it's only thanks to the string, but having the critical plus very hard shots, plus knowing how to, uh, to play correctly versus volley players, well. That makes uh, a hard third rematch. Well, that was well played. Yep, very well played, Matteo seven five zero. Okay, well, at least I improved the total score to sixty four. It may be enough to qualify. Was not a very nice uh, qualifying round. Here is the scorecard. Yep, three defeats. And I'm going to show you the uh, the burns of my opponent soon. But before that, we are going to see the other participants in my bracket. A lot of good players and top players who have won 
finish their matches yet or are they haven't uh, started playing he had a boons yep showing you the uh, corner string very cute string the boon of ks17 that i faced two times and we are 77 using the keto sourcing K17 again, Fabio13 who was using this uh, power lifting card. So uh, he had uh, a lower serve but uh, much better stamina. It is good to face other volley players. Expresso MSD. This one is a more classic build already with the increased hydration and not the keto sourcing. Derb, who was playing with Tomahawk. And the power lifting too. Okay, and here are the other boons. All right. Well, I hope you enjoy watching me play the Challenger qualifying round of the Australia Biodiversity Open Tennis Clash, a sports game published by Wider Live Studios. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel Gameplay365 and to turn on the bell to stay tuned for new videos of Tennis Clash. Thank you a lot for your support, and see you soon in Gameplay365. Bye-bye.